Um, the crew is ready to receive um, Dragon on Sunday morning about 6 a.m. Central Time. Uh, Mark Vandehei is the uh, prime robotics operator. Uh, Joe Okaba uh, is the support. And uh, we're very much looking forward to 4,800 pounds of critical research, resupply, and spares uh, arriving at ISS on Sunday. Good morning, or it's almost afternoon now. So yeah, this was just a fantastic way to end the year for SpaceX East Coast launches. We started off the year with a 10th cargo resupply mission to the space station, and that was actually the first launch out of the reactivated historic pad 39A. That's the same launch pad that astronauts flew to the moon on, many shuttle missions, and then we reactivated that pad. And CRS-10 was the first mission to launch off of that pad earlier this year. Then, as you all saw today, we had the newly built Pad 40, and it was great to have another CRS mission, our fourth Dragon of this year, launch off that pad for the first time on the first attempt. It's just a great day all around. If I could have one more follow-up for Heavy. Um, I was wondering if you could address any of the roadblocks, pun intended, uh, that you may be dealing with to fly a Tesla into space. <laughs> uh -huh. So uh, I will just say that we are following all regulations. So you know, it's still um, these are still licensed launches. So we still follow all the rules that we need to follow um, launching out of Kennedy Space Center. Um, we follow all FAA regulations, FCC. So we are following all the regulations, including for the Roadster. <laughs>
and she being with child cried, travailing in birth, and pained to be delivered. And there appeared another wonder in heaven, and behold, a great red dragon, having seven heads and ten horns, and seven crowns upon his heads. And his tail drew the third part of the stars of heaven, and did cast them to the earth. And the dragon stood before the woman which was ready to be delivered, for to devour her child as soon as it was born. And she brought forth a man-child, who was to rule all nations with a rod of iron. And her child was caught up unto God and to his throne. And the woman fled into the wilderness, where she hath a place prepared of God, that they should feed her there a thousand two hundred and threescore days. And there was war in heaven. Michael and his angels fought against the dragon. And the dragon fought, and his angels, and prevailed not. Neither was their place found any more in heaven. And the great dragon was cast out, that old serpent called the devil and Satan, which deceiveth the whole world. He was cast out into the earth, and his angels were cast out with him. And I heard a loud voice saying in heaven, Now is come salvation and strength, and the kingdom of our God and the power of his Christ. For the accuser of our brethren is cast down, which accused them before our God day and night. And they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb, and by the word of their testimony, and they loved not their lives unto the death.